Right, I know who we've got here, but I'm going to ask him to introduce his handsome self. <laughs> okay, my name is Iken Obi. Um I'm an actor, I'm a blogger, I'm an activist. Activist. Okay, we're going to talk about the <laughs> movie, but I heard activists. I'm thinking, what? What are you protesting about? <laughs> well, um, about the movie first, or about the protesting? No, about the, the movie. Protesting, protesting, oh, the protesting. protesting. Well, the protesting is um, I, 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 I try to um, speak out for injustice, especially injustice. It, it doesn't matter where it is, yeah. if it's black, white, whatever it is. But at the moment, I'm concentrated on the injustice taking place in. America in South Africa against black people, um, like the ones going on with the um, unnecessary shooting of black people, which you see on social media. You see the videos clearly with the evidences um, against the ones happening in South Africa. The young girls in South Africa are being asked to untie their or tie their hair up um, and not go with the natural hair that they have. So I feel that all those things are not fair. There's no purpose for it because it doesn't um, hinder anybody's progress or anything like that. And uh, with the unnecessary um, sh shootings that are happening in America as well, it's, it's, it's clear evidence there that it's um, injustice against people of a certain race, of a certain culture. And um, there is no need for that. We can all live in peace. We can all live, in, li live like brothers and sisters. Exactly. I love that. But so being an activist and being an actor, how do you combine them? Are they not, you know, um, I mean, because an actor, you're there to entertain yeah, yeah, an activist true. as well. So how do you combine the two roles? What I do is, as an activist, you have to tell the truth. Yeah. So what I do is I tell the truth. It might not be appealing to certain people. Uh, some people um, are unhappy with it. Some people attack me verbally with it, um, saying, oh, you shouldn't be saying this, you shouldn't be saying that. But at the same time, I'm an actor as an entertainer as well, but that doesn't mean I need to turn a blind eye to what's actually happening. Because if I turn a blind eye to what's happening, that means I'm a hypocrite, which obviously I'm not that kind of person. I'm someone who will speak up. And it doesn't just have to do with black people. It could be anything against children, against uh, women. Um, like there was a recent comment being made uh, by um, the president of Nigeria where he undermined women a lot. And I did protest and I did directly um, uh, confront mm -hmm him on social media on my two platforms Instagram and Twitter I did confront uh, confront him and I did say to him that what he said was wrong yeah. and an apology is in order mm -hmm. and um, I'm glad that actress um, Af um, African actress Hilda Dukubo yeah. did respond but unfortunately she's the only female who's actually said something which is a bad thing you know I don't know why people are so scared. I can understand that some people might be scared because mm -hmm. things might happen. But at the end of the day, you have to speak up yeah. for, for what's... Yeah. If, if something's going wrong, you have to speak up against it. No, I, I, I really, really love the fact that you... Even though you're an actor, and yeah. because it, p people do say that when you're, in, when you're in the entertainment business, you have to be very careful yeah. because yeah, of true. your, you know... True, true. You know, it's, 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 very, it's a great area. Um, yeah. I've had some people say to me, look, if you continue with this activist part, mm -hmm. you will end up not having anything mm -hmm. at all. But you know what? I'd rather choose the right path than choosing the path of glory whereby I will be staying like someone who basically has nothing. Because basically, if, if I can't speak of for injustices taking place, then I'm basically yeah. worthless. Yes. That's how I see myself personally. I'm not saying anyone out there should feel like that, but that's how I see myself. And yeah, I have to speak up. But you know what, um, Iken, uh, we, are, we are here, we are happy yeah. that you're doing the same thing. We are doing something like that yeah. because you're in this movie. Yeah, exactly. So exactly. tell us a little bit about your character. Okay, my character, uh, my character, okay. My character is someone who was a suspect among something that happened in the film. Mm -hmm. um, so I was being taken in for questioning. Mm -hmm. um, and then I had to do my part. Mm -hmm. uh, and then it rolls on to finding out the culprits who mm -hmm. actually committed whatever it is that was committed. Mm -hmm. And you find that out when we go into the cinema. So we're, we're going to go now. Thank you very much Thank for you. speaking to us.